Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you several polishes from Red Eyed Lacquer, including their Going Solo Fall Collection, their Halloween Duo, and also several other polishes that will be in different boxes, such as the Polish Gamers Box, the Charity Box, Hella Handmade Creations, etc. So I'm going to start off with this neutralizing base coat called Mellow That Yellow. Um, if you have really yellow nails that are stained from polish, this base coat would be a good option for you because the purple tint helps cancel out that yellow, those yellow tones in your nail. So you can see me applying here. I'm only applying one coat and I'll put this under the orange on the collection and I'm just comparing it to my ring finger and middle finger so you can kind of see the difference between a regular base coat and a neutralizing base coat. So I'm going to start with the Going Solo Fall Collection and this is What the Cuss. It's a milk chocolate brown cream. And this cream collection in my opinion is more of a crelly like formula. So it does have that sheer jelly quality so you are going to need two to three coats for each of these polishes. Um, here on this brown I used two coats but for my swatched pictures I did go ahead and apply a third coat to make sure it was completely opaque and that's what you'll see in the pictures three coats so next is secret plans and clever tricks this is an olive green cream and if you saw my um, our favorites for fall video you already saw this polish because it was one of my olive options for fall if you haven't seen our video I will link it in the description box and in the cards above so I applied three coats for this polish to get it completely opaque again it's a curly formula but it's very shiny it's not as dark as some olive creams are it's a little bit lighter so if you like that look this is a good olive option So next I'm applying No One Who Is Good Can Never Be Ugly. So this is an orange cream and I like to call it a pumpkin orange cream. I think it's a really good pumpkin cream color and this was also in my, this was also a favorite of mine and was in my Our Favorites for Fall video. I did have to apply three coats. I did put that mellow, that yellow base coat underneath, but I still needed three coats. I don't know, maybe I applied a couple more coats, but I don't know. I don't really like doing that. So just three coats for this one. It'll give you a nice pumpkin orange color. dreams is full of magic and mystery and this is a deep navy cream this one covered completely in only two coats it kind of looks crazy on one coat um, this one does run a little bit so make sure to apply really thin coats so it doesn't get everywhere a great option I'm not sure if this stains your nails because I didn't wear it that long so um, just be sure to wear a good base coat underneath Next color is called but he made it to the end it is a deep brick red cream and I think it's showing up a little lighter on camera once you completely build this up in two to three coats it will be like it says a deep red cream but it's not showing up as deep on camera but you can see it in my swatch pictures um, good formula again try to apply a very thin coat so it doesn't run into your cuticles same formula as the other one acrylic like formula the next polish 
is it doesn't matter who you are or what you look like so long as someone loves you. This is a deep eggplant purple cream. I think this was one of the more runnier formulas in the collection. Still a curly formula, but you definitely want to be careful with your coats on this one. If you can see on that first coat, I had a lot of pooling around the edges of my nails. So this one did require three coats for me to be completely opaque and kind of get rid of that sheer look. But it looks really pretty once you apply the three coats. in this collection is actually a topper the topper is going to be ten dollars whereas the creams are eight dollars and fifty cents each but if you purchase if you purchase the entire seven piece collection is fifty two dollars i layered it over the navy in this collection and i think this topper looks the best over this polish in my pictures i put it over the purple and it still looks good but i think that that navy base just brings out those green and blue flakes so next I'm going to be showing you the Halloween duo that's going to release Thursday, October 15th at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time for $11 each or for $20 for the duo. The first polish is It's the Great Pumpkin. This is a deep gray with orange, red, copper, gold, shifting flakies and green gold micro flakies. So this polish again has that curly like formula. I think it's showing up as a black on camera and even in my pictures it leans more towards black but it is actually a deep gray in person. I applied three coats in the pictures and in the video for this one. Next polish is called I Got a Rock, which is a white curly with blue slash purple shifting flakies and green cyan sapphire UCC flakies. So this one looks opaque in two coats from the swatches, but I did apply a third coat because I think in person it needed that extra third coat to be completely opaque. This one's really pretty. It does remind me of a rock with all the really tiny flakes in it. polish is from the October charity box so the October's theme is comfy and cozy and will be benefiting mental health America so the pre-order sale will run from October 8th through the 17th on shopcharitybox.com which I'll link in the description box this polish is called I'm Coco for you it is a milk chocolate crelly with copper and gold hollow and golden shifting flakes it will be $12.50 with a $100 cap. So this is available now um, at the charitybox.com. I really like this one because I like the milk chocolate as well as the hollow that like really stands out in the sun. And you'll see that in my pictures. So Red Eyed Lacquer is joining Hella Handmade Creations this month. Starting with October, she had is going to have the Sandlot themed polishes. So this first one is called The Beast. It is a nude crelly with bronze green UCC flakies, gold green chameleon flakies, and yellow green pink shifting flakies. The cap on this will be 10, sorry, well, the cap on this will be 100. This will be available October 14th at 12.01 a.m. Eastern Standard Time through October 21st at 11.59 p.m. Hawaiian time at www.handmadecreations.com and I will leave that in the description box as well. So again, I applied three coats for this one, three thin coats. I really like this one matte. So if you like this polish, 
The information for that will be in the description box. Red Eyed Lacquer's contribution to October's Polished Gamers box. This month's, theme, this month's theme is Pokemon, and she chose Char Charizard. I don't watch Pokemon, so I don't know how to say that. I'm sorry. It's called Mega Evolved. It is a teal crelly with orange, pink, gold, teal, shifting flakies. Mega Evolver will be $12.50 with a cap of $100 and will release on the Polish Gamer site for pre-order October 15th through the 20th at 2 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So I ended up applying three coats for this, three thin coats for this polish. It is a jelly type formula. So for it to be completely opaque, you will need three coats. The last polish is called Notorious RBG in honor of the late Justice Ginsburg. It is a bold blue hollow with purple teal shifting shimmer and aqua purple pink shifting flakies. It will be $11 with $5 of every bottle being donated to one of Justice Ginsburg's favorite charities, Malala Fund Fighting for Girls Education. The polish will be available for pre-order on the Red Eyed Lacquer website from October 9th through the 16th at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And turnaround time will be about one week. This was a pretty polish. I only applied two coats. Um, I do think you can get this opaque in two to three coats, but I have shorter nails. I was able to get it opaque in only two. I really like this one too because it ha also has hollow in it, which I love hollow polishes. And I also love blue polishes, so... If you love to support charities, be sure to support this one. Again, the information will all be in the description box, so please check please check that out. Those are all of Red Eyed Lacquer's October polishes, so be sure to support her. And thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any videos from me, and I will see you again soon. Bye, guys.